My beautiful Sapix, today I want to put you guys into the new mini-series called The Confessions of Franny Langton. Although it is a story about a woman's quest to prove she's innocent, it is also, above all, a beautiful lesbian love story between Franny and the woman she works for, Madame Marguerite Perham. We say something, what we did. We haven't even spoken about it. You will not speak about it. It is sending me mad. I am your mistress, Francis. What if I could say I wanted it? What if you could say you wanted it too? Some things cannot be brought into the light. And let it be done in the dark. You are a surprise. I don't want to be a surprise. Haven't you done it before? One of my favorite things about the show is how it strips away the shame of homosexuality, choosing to explore the intimacy of their love instead. <sighs> I was coming to find you. I'll stay in the dark, if that's where you are. Their love is a secret. However, there is a certain freedom in which they can enjoy their connection, making a huge difference in how their story is told. A pinch of happiness, like salt into a cake, which meant, of course, that it couldn't last. I don't want to give too much away because I honestly want you to go and check the series. Her? For breaking their rules? I should not. Why not? Why not? We must be our own women. We must please ourselves! Me? <laughs> For not knowing my place? Not staying in it? We should leave. The flashback scenes do an amazing job at developing Franny and Marguerite's intimacy step by step. They draw us into how two women from completely different backgrounds grow together in love. I let myself want something. And I let myself imagine she might want it too. Their romance is portrayed in a sexy, sensual, tender and beautiful way. The forbidden nature of their relationship and the build-up to their romance and increasing intimacy feels natural to the plot and within this period drama. I want you to be proud to be with me. I want to be proud with you. I want to touch you. When you want me to. I want all of those impossible things. And while the events in the series are fictional, they are born out of a real life desire to see authentic black characters in historical fiction. What are you doing here? Someone might come. Then I will hide under the bed. Set in the 1800s, the show is a painful, beautiful queer story. Sadly, it doesn't have a happy ending. But still, it is a great mini-series, and please trust me, the scenes together are so beautiful to watch. I have love in me the likes of which you can scarcely imagine, and rage the likes of which you would not believe. When we were alone, together, we were simply two women, never woman and me. All episodes are available to stream now, and you can find them on ITVX. Francis. I was listening with my eyes closed. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want more? Yes. You can't have it. You have to stay here. All morning. I hope you enjoyed today's video and thank you so much for watching.